Hello guys, this is Gio, and in this video I'm gonna pick the Anchor last disc detainer padlock made in Sweden. Uh, this padlock is a model uh, 810-1, uh, so it's the smaller, uh, smallest padlock I have, I believe. And that means I cannot get it, I cannot show you what's inside. So if you want to see what's inside, I suggest you to watch Captain uh, Hook's uh, video on YouTube. He takes uh, his larger padlock uh, apart so you can see what's inside. So as I said, it's a disc, det disc detainer lock. This is a key. So it ki um, it's kind of similar to, to a bloy. And this is a profile. As you can see, it's a weird uh, rectangle with a cat in the corner here. So if you can see well, this is a kind of keyway we are dealing with. So um, since I don't have any uh, pick that fit inside, I had to make uh, one myself. So I took uh, those Chinese uh, disc detainer lock, I shaped uh, the tensioner here to fit into the, the keyway, and I made my own picking tip using a nail that I filed, uh, I filed on to this shape using a Dremel. Took me uh, the whole morning. But uh, it works. All right, so let's start picking. So first, this padlock, this uh, zonko last can be tension uh, rear or front. So this is a front tensioner. But I'm gonna just simply put my picking tip far down and pick the um, the last disc already turn it to um, 90 degrees so that it's it's done I don't I don't have to to worry about it so it's a little bit tricky to do because um, it's a profile disc so my my picking tip fits just right oh there I go oops I slipped okay my picking tips slip just right. The other discs are quite uh, larger, they have a lot of um, cutout to them, so it's easier to, to pick. All right, so now I turn the front disc to 90 degrees. I can now insert uh, my pick. And we can start picking. All right, so that uh, lock uh, binds kind of uh, back to front so first I'm gonna go to the back and I need to put all those discs into um, false or true gates it doesn't matter just a gate okay So I just turn this and bind until they give or something. Until I feel they wiggle a little bit when I uh, use my pick. All right, that one is set. Let's go back. That one is uh, is not binding. Next one. I think there are ten discs in total. Okay. Mm -hmm -hmm. That one free spins. That one is binding, but cannot feel if it's in a gate or not. Let's go to the next one. That one is alright. Next one. Last one. That one is good. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, sorry, I'm just gonna put that 
like this so it's more comfortable for you okay okay so I'm back at the bottom and the most annoying thing with uh, this is trying to get the, the tip out I mean out of the space between the the discs I have a binding disc here but I'm not sure okay I think that looks good okay that one is set next one Okay, that is good. We are getting there. I, you can, uh, I hear some clicks there and there. Okay, one is good. Oops, no, went out of. Okay, okay one is good. And when all the discs are in a gate clearly feel it, um, the tensioner goes a little bit uh, further. Okay. tip is stuck there we go it's difficult to stay on the on the discs they sleep a lot okay that is good okay let's go back down I think we're almost there very soon okay back down let's check this disc if I can put my picking tip on it, it's a little bit stuck right now. Come on, there we go. Okay, that disc is set to the next one. Mm. My tension tip keeps slipping. There we go, and slipped again. Come on, dude, can make it, can do it. <coughs> okay, okay, that one is binding. Okay, good. It's good. And it's good. It's good. Okay, one is binding here. Binding quite hard. Come on, ah, keep slipping. There we go. Whew. 
okay that was the last one that was that, that was was it was binding very very hard all right there you go uh Ancolas, uh this gets in a lock picked with uh, this awesome uh, homemade tool thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed